Good morning, Calvary, and welcome to your word for the day. My name is Pastor Mitch, and today our verses are Matthew chapter 6, verses 5 through 18. And today we're talking about being honest in our prayers. You know, oftentimes praying can feel weird or awkward, especially when it's in front of others. If it is something that we don't, don't normally do, then being put on the spot to pray for a meal or on special occasions or in a life group with your friends. When finding the right words to say without sounding stupid, it can seem daunting. And sometimes we feel like we need to say more words to be more spiritual, that the longer our prayers are, the holier and closer to God we are. But Jesus gives us some direction in Matthew chapter 6. He says this, When you pray, don't be like the hypocrites who love to pray publicly on street corners and in the synagogues where everyone can see them. I tell you the truth, this is all the reward they will ever get. But when you pray, go away by yourself, shut the door behind you, and pray to your Father in private. Then your Father who sees everything will reward you. When you pray, don't babble on and on as the Gentiles do. They think their prayers are answered merely by repeating their words again and again. Don't be like them, for your Father knows exactly what you need even before you ask Him. Yes, God simply wants us to be real and authentic with Him. He doesn't want us to pretend to be more holy. He isn't your high school English teacher that is, that is expecting a certain word count. He's not impressed by our good deeds or the way that we feel superior to others. He wants us to have a real authentic relationship with Him and when we do that, God will notice that and he will reward us by drawing us even closer to him. This is how Jesus tells us to pray. Continuing on in, in verse 9, he says, Pray like this, Our Father in heaven, may your name be kept holy. May your kingdom come soon. May your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today the food we need and forgive us our sins as we have forgiven those who sin against us. And don't let us yield to temptation, but rescue us from the evil one. If you forgive those who sin against you, your heavenly Father will forgive you. But if you refuse to forgive others, your Father will not forgive your sins. And when you fast, don't make it obvious as the hypocrites do, for they try to look miserable and dis disheveled so people will admire them for their fasting. I tell you the truth, that is the only reward they will ever get. But when you fast, comb your hair and wash your face. Then no one will notice that you are fasting except your Father, who knows what you do in private and your Father who sees everything will reward you. Guys, be real and authentic with God today. If you've never really been one to pray, start today. Start talking to God today. And if you typically find yourself saying the same words over and over again, or dragging your prayers out because that's how you were taught, shorten them up or make them longer. It doesn't matter. Just be real and authentic in your prayers, knowing that God wants to have a real relationship with you. Thank you for tuning in to your word for the day. Like and share this video, and we will see you tomorrow.